And this is why I'm the luckiest person in the world. This is what I woke up to this morning. It's me and my cat. Look how cute he is. I love him. It's not her with the beaching rest face. This is legs. He's always happy. Well, he's not even happy, but he has a human nose, so he's so cute. Yeah, and that's me wearing my Rapunzel cosplay headpiece that I made. Woo woo! Oh, I'm so lucky. I just wanted to share how lucky I am. I am still just on cloud nine with excitement. Sorry, I just heard the mailman. I'm waiting for a package. So I'm like, oh, is it Loot Crate? No. Wah, wah. So excited about the new D23 news. Um, can we talk about it, please? First of all, Whoopi Goldberg. Enough said. I am so excited. Uh, she's doing the panel. I believe it's the Saturday at 6 o'clock, stage 28, I want to say. And I cannot wait. It's going to be so cool just because she's phenomenal and I know how much she loves Disney and one of the main things she loves about Disney is basically the same with me, like my mom, our moms. Our moms always wanted to bring us there and take us there and like I've said before, when my mother was in a coma, when she came out of her coma, that's what we did. It was like, I want to take Elise to Disney World and I was like 18, but it was like the best experience of my life and... Due to that, I think it's made my love for Disney grow and blossom and get a little obsessive. But isn't that what life's all about? <laughs> Obsessing over things. <laughs> uh, so I'm excited to see her. Then I read that they're doing a parade? Or something like that? Like a Mardi Gras where like, uh, I feel like it's the first time ever at D23 that they're probably like, get these people outside. So I'm assuming it's when the day's over and you go, it said that legends that got inducted would be like the Grand Master Parade tier guy. And one of them is uh, Mark Hamill. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I don't know Star Wars, but Luke. Yes, Luke. And I don't get it. And I think they're like, ooh, and then they said there's characters and stuff, and I was like, what? So we get like a mini parade at D23 every day? It's fun. I'm like, babe, we're gonna have to make a whole new shelf of just D23 merch, because like, it's gonna be crazy. The only thing I think helping me about D23 merchandise is the fact that I'm not wasting my, no, okay, that's rude, because people are gonna, I'm not gonna stand in line for shops. I wish I could, can never go to, like I super want to, but there's just so much awesome panels going on that I'm like, well, I'd rather do that. Plus I am going to Disneyland when I'm there and I'm like, well, I'll be able to get some stuff when I'm at Disneyland, hopefully that I want like ears, like Disneyland ears I wanna, we both wanna buy. <laughs> Sorry, that's so rude. And knowing me like a mug <laughs> and hopefully zoom zooms zoom 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 zooms because I just saw the new release of the zoom zooms and they're like bug uh up and ratatouille but up are you kidding me and it's like the out of it is so cute it's them floating with balloons and they're all stacked on each other and then the bird's like wah, wah, off to the side I can't remember the bird's name Kookaboo Boo 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 has he become a Funko Pop yet the bird because that would be a beautiful Funko Pop on a super side note. Because he's a really cute Zoom Zoom. Because he already like looks like a Zoom Zoom. It's like weird little duck face. So I hope to find those. And I like hope by some miracle like the Haunted Mansion Zoom Zooms from like a year and a half ago or so. There. I know they're not. But I'm just like maybe they'll just be at the like convention center. Like in that area, the pavilion area where people just sell stuff. Uh, I'm hoping. And like all the pins that are gonna be there, like I love pins, so that would be fun for me to shop there. Uh, yeah, so today's just a quick video because yes, I'm going to work this double, so I will not have time to do any filming or posting at all. And yesterday on George's day off, because he's amazing, he helped my dad build a deck. It was like the hottest day of the year so far, it was so hot and like, 
they both build a deck, and I think that was super sweet and awesome. Oh, and Luther now hopped up. Are you involved, Luther? Luther is the most beautiful cat in the world. Ha ha ha. That's like the most personal she'll get with me. <laughs> yeah, is it your life? Is it your life and we're all living in it? Yeah. Yeah. Can you see yourself? Does she stare? She she has bitching rest face all the time. <laughs> that is just her face. I love it. Uh yeah. So yeah, thanks for watching. I do appreciate everyone who's watching and I'm excited to keep doing these and it's really like inspiring me to do more and more and more and more. It's just with life, it is a lot of work, even though they're just like, like yesterday I have to admit was like a wood boat day because the video is only like two minutes, not even, it was like three seconds shy of two minutes. But I put a lot of editing into it and I, for me, I mean, I'm, I'm sure to some of you what you watch, it's lame, but for me, it was a lot. And I'm just kind of, getting into it and doing it and yes some days will probably be those two minute videos but they upload quick i was able to do some really cool editing and it was awesome so i'm not mad about it and i hope you're not mad about it but yeah basically gonna go hop in the shower real quick do a classic girl shower don't wash my hair wash my body so it's quick <laughs> And then I'm going to work. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good day, bye-bye. So today I wanted to show you, I had this plant for a while. I call it a creepy Jenny. And if you ever see it, it's amazing as it grows so big. So I just cut it. And then I got all these strands, all these strands. Now, cuz I know I got hoarders, she's I can't just throw it away because I'm attached to the plant. So, as a little tip, take it. I let it sit out for like three days in the sun, just harden it off, cut the end off. See how this part's a little growth, not gross, but not it. Like, this is like fresh. I would even cut that off. So, then you can even take this leaf off so you have more of a clear ending. I have a pot right here, and I just poke to hold my finger and stick it down. Now, some people put rooting hormone, but this plant is amazing. You can abuse this plant, and it just grows and grows and grows. So, this tree's in the way. Sorry, y'all. Just, I have like a few pots that I think I'm just gonna fill with this, not waste it. Uh, it does prefer shade. So this corner right here is super shady. Ooh. Just fine. Oh, look at this one, super healthy. Thing when you're garden gardening that you have to remember is I'm always said you can't be scared of the plant they are very stubborn and strong and they want to live and propagate 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 they want to have sex you know okay you know what word I mean I can't say words they want to live and they'll do anything to survive they're strong versatile you just gotta know what you wanna do.
the only thing that really gets plants, I find, is if you get... Oops, sorry. Like, an infestation with a bug. Uh, bugs will work. So see how pretty that looks now? And here's an up-close look of what it looks like. Super cute, it's on like a spoon.